Hey, Pastor Dan here on this rainy Thursday. Uh, NFL Draft Day, though, by the way, Thursday, tonight at 8 p.m. Uh, but anyway, say hey, off topic, we're talking about forgiveness uh, at our church right now. And Jesus said something very counter-cultural. Jesus said to love your enemies and pray uh, for those who persecute you. Uh, so those that have hurt you, uh, those that have created this debt, and it may be real hard for you to choose to cancel that debt and forgive them. Jesus says, hey, I want you to pray uh, for them. And the word prayer actually means an exchange, an exchange between human ideas and divine ideas. When we go to God and begin to pray, we take God, our human thoughts about a person, a situation, and then God gives us his divine thoughts by faith faith, there's a divine persuasion to direct us. So we asked a question this last week, you know, how do I know uh, when we should reconcile or even if we should reconcile? Uh, how, how do we know what kind of boundaries to set up for healing and all these kind of things? Well, prayer, prayer is really the answer because God will give you his thoughts and direction. And if you obey, if you obey, God will lead you to the place of forgiveness always and will lead you to the place of of reconciliation, even uh, either on this side of eternity, and if it doesn't happen here, on the other side of eternity. So uh, I want you to remember this about prayer. Prayer may not change them, but prayer will always change you. So let's take the words of Jesus when it comes to this area of hurt and forgiveness, all right? Jesus says, love your enemies and pray for those who persecute you. Well, hey, we hope to see you this coming Sunday, Mission Sunday. We're very excited. Missionaries from Romania will be streaming in live. It's going to be an awesome Sunday. Hope you see you in person at 930 or 11 or online live streaming at 11 a.m. God bless you. Have a great, great day.